It's not every day Wellesley students are invited to the Massachusetts State House, but May 6th was different. And today we have great examples of the work that the next generation is concerned about and is doing. Uh, so on behalf of Governor Patrick, I just want to say we know that the next generation is in great hands with your leadership. Not just one, but two Wellesley schools were honored at the 20th Annual Secretary's Awards for Excellence in Energy and Environmental Education. Wellesley High School, along with Wellesley Green Schools, a group of parents and teachers that try and inspire students to create a healthy and sustainable world, received first honors for their No Idling campaign. Back in February, they teamed up with the Wellesley Police Department to launch Turn Your Key, Be Idle Free. I mean, I think so many people with most of these things that we just do them. We don't really think about them. We're sitting in the car, we're just waiting for our child to pick up at soccer or at school or at music and we leave the car running, whether it's 40 degrees, it's 10 degrees, it's 70 degrees. Um, it's just sort of unfortunately a bad habit. And so this campaign was really about educating people about why they shouldn't. And when you start thinking about like, oh yeah, these kids are inhaling all these toxic chemicals. We have so much asthma in our community. People will stop and say, wait a minute, I'm gonna just turn my key and turn the car off. And that's really what it's all about is that making people just change their habits. And that's exactly the type of program the state's Energy and Environmental Affairs Department honors. Students, teachers, and nonprofits raising awareness about energy and environmental issues affecting Massachusetts and the planet. I thought it was really cool to get to go up there with all these other different groups that also have done a whole variety of different things in their schools and communities of similar nature or very different nature. Especially when one of the other winners is from your community. From Wellesley, the John D. Hardy Elementary School. Hardy was awarded third honors for its green team program, a recognition high schoolers were excited for them to get. I think the earlier they get involved with it, the stronger it guarantees the program will be as they get older and then they can do bigger stuff. Winners compete for $5,000 in awards funded by the Massachusetts Environmental Trust to help create additional environmental education initiatives at the school. WHS took home $400 while Hardy was awarded $100. Money that will be put to good use back at home as organizations think of new ways to go green. You may see Wellesley Police not ticketing, but we have these cards that they're going to be giving out saying thank you for not idling um, and it gives some facts about why idling is not so bad. And so. Um, if you get one, thank you for not idling, and take it and then share it with somebody, whether you're in the parking lot at you know, one of the local schools or at a parking lot in the shopping mall. In all, 22 schools and five nonprofits were awarded at this year's State House ceremony. For Wellesley Media, I'm Natalie Kaplan.